Hey guys, welcome to Easy Peasy Redstone, a tutorial series where I- WHAT?! Pig, you are going way over the speed limit! Pull your cart over! Alright, so, here we go! We're back with the redstone, we're back here! And what better way to come back than to show you guys a little circuit that I made, because, you know, always day I wanna you, know, you want to work on your projects, you don't want it to get dark on you. Okay, I was using something along the lines of this, and then a block like that, and then burn. Okay, but uh, it just it turned dark. I don't want it to turn dark at all. So, you know, I kind of looked up a few uh, designs, and I did come across one that I really liked. It was by Ni Mice, Ni Mice, 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 Mice Nark. He's a Nark. He's a mouse, and he's a Nark. Nice Mark MC. If you like the redstone and you don't know him, I I highly recommend his channel. He's really good at redstone. Anyways, I saw his design and I thought, you know what, I, I think I could shave a little off, off of this. So I decided to take matters into my own hands and come up with my own design. And so here we go. Now, um, uh, you know, the, oh, the, the command block. You need a command block, so you have to give it to yourself. Not a lot of the videos that I looked up really showed you how to do this. So you type in give your name. Kid Mischief 137, there's your command block right there. So all we gotta do is place that there, dig in there, time set to 1000, that's important. So we go uh, comparator right into that, and a uh, furnace right here. Now, we go in here and we're gonna reach, reach in there, and then we're gonna get a stack and a half. Okay, if you're wondering how I did that, all you gotta do is middle click. You just middle click and it, oops, middle click and it creates, create, what am, it creates another stack for you like this middle click middle click anyways uh enough of that so you put a stack and a half in there and you put uh, uh one of those little uh, what what is this like it looks like a what is that anyways and then you put this in there and blah. it's so simple i'm not even describing what i'm doing come on come on look at this sunlight detector pretty little that's it that's all you need all right and let me show you where is the sun coming up is something okay let me show you where um uh i think it's 11 400 so the sun gets like about here and the there you go time gets set back to here so it never turns dark ever not even a little bit that's it that's all that's it so easy so this is why it's called easy peasy isn't it all right now uh that's it for the circuit what i'm going to get what i'm going to jump into next because it's you know it's kind of related to um to this uh and also uh, a lot of people have asked me this question so i might as well just throw it in i'm going to show you how to make a map the map that I work in, okay, and this is, uh, you know, how to put the iron down, um, and, um, you know, what preset and blah, blah, blah. Some of you already know this, if you knew, if you know, just stop the video now, okay, go away. But, <laughs> but anyway, I've been, I've been asked enough that, to me, it warranted me, including, um, how to make this map. So, up next, let me show you how to make the map. Here we go. All right, so to create your map, you're going to go to Create New World, and then you're going to name it. I'm going to name mine Subatomic Hell. That is an inside joke. Don't worry about it. Okay, let's go to Game Mode, Creative, More World Options. We're going to turn off Generate Structures. We're going to go to World Type and choose Super Flat and then Customize. Okay, Right here, we're going to go to Presets, go all the way down, Redstone Ready. Now, these numbers right here. The one that you want to change is this one right here, okay? This is the block ID. So what I do is set it to 42. Of course, you can, you know, uh, look it up and put whatever block you want there, whatever block ID. I choose iron blocks because the iron blocks uh, have a little border around them, and it's easy to tell, you know, from block to block. You could count the blocks easily, and that way it helps you, you know, gauge distance, uh, tell dimensions, and blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. Anyways, and it looks cool. So that's that. I put 42. Use the preset. Done. Create new world. And it loads. And it load. Boring. Okay, there it goes. So anyways, that's it. This is how you create it. And as you can see, that preset puts you in a desert. So you do not have to worry about rain. The only thing you have to worry about is the sunlight. And of course, we covered that earlier. So there you go. I hope this helps. And um, that is all. I, I'm forgetting something. What did I used to say in these videos? Oh, right. Go away! So, to create your map, we're going to go to Create New World. And, of course, we're going to name it Sub... Sub-Zero. Sub-Zero. Finish him. Fatality. 